I don't know how he made it this far with this Illuminati drama, but we're actually on round eight. Or is it seven? I don't know. I miscount because, man, is she a fighter. A stubborn child throwing a fit, thinking that they're going to get what they want because they expect the world to conform to their wishes. But unfortunately, in the words of Wolverine, sorry, bub. That ain't happening. A month later, and it's still not over, and the craziest part is, another member of Sad Milk still has a response video to make. And outside of that, this rabbit hole is so much deeper than you'd originally think. There's stuff that I plan on covering that dates back to years before. Last video, I briefly talked about how Illuminati was attacking Wonder, the person whose suicide letter that she leaked on the internet because she saw him as an easy target and tried to silence him with legal action by sending him a cease and desist. It seems as though with her career going down the drain, she's trying to drag everyone else with her. If I had to describe Illuminati as anything, she'd definitely be an iceberg and her group Sad Milk would have been the Titanic. At this point, I think it's about time she pulls a jack and lets this shit fucking go. Because at the end of the day, at this point, your ship will no longer be sailing in these YouTube waters. And speaking of icebergs, holy shit, I can only imagine what an Illuminati iceberg video would end up like. Because shit, this just might have to be a case study. Set the programmer knew when to take the L. Creepshow Art knew when to take the L. Cyrus knew when he should have took the L. I don't understand why shit is not registering in her fucking brain. I've said it once, and I'll say it a thousand times because I feel like I said this in every single video. I talk about this chicken. She's a Karen, brain rotted to the core, self-centered freak who does not understand social norms, a manipulative, egotistical, toxic fucking harpy. If you've ever wanted to see a good threshold on how toxic a female could be, this is a perfect example. This is not the type of woman you'd ever want to date. And if you see any signs in any female or male, because men can do the same thing too, you better get the fuck out of there and cut that relationship a s a fucking p. Even after doing all those things to wonder, she has proceeded to attack the same member she had this long sob story and message in in her video with a shit ton of crocodile tears talking about some us oh, I, I wish we could be, be, be friends okay, okay. ugly ass voice bruh literally when she had that whole sob story response in her video oz reacted to it and he's like i seen blair built those tears up on more than one occasion that bitch is lying he already knew take a good guess guess what the same guy that she supposedly cried over, supposedly, excuse me, supposedly cried over, she tries to attack him with legal action as well, sending him a cease and desist for doing absolutely nothing. I really do hope they take this to court so Illumi the judge could just see how dumb this motherfucker is, and so Oz and Wonder could sue the fuck out of her and take everything that she owns. Because this scumbag shit should not be tolerated. How are you going to try some big brain shit with the law when these guys have evidence against everything that you've done against them? You're literally just digging your own grave. I don't know why it's just funny to me because I just thought of Ed from Ed and Eddie just saying, Dig a hole. Dig. I miss that show. I'm not gonna lie, his voice actor went crazy for capturing those levels of, like, stupidity. Just raw, unfiltered <laughs> stupidity. It's just like Illuminati. Somebody pass me some popcorn. Oz continues to say, So Illuminati has officially sent me a cease and desist. Best part is she cites parts of videos which I had no part in and demands I make a public apology. Citing, bro. I'm telling you, the courtroom is about to have a field day on her, bro. Illuminati thinks she can pull some Von Karma shit, but nah, bro. Phoenix gonna be on that shit. And like I said before about the other member making an exposed video, a response video on her, it's this dude, Oz. 
I don't know if I'm tweaking or not. Somebody, please inform me in the comment section below. But it seems like those guys, them two might have had some past together or something. Because I remember him mentioning that before in Wonder's video about them two living together and having some sort of history. I don't know exactly, but I'm really curious on what Oz has to say. Because it seems as though he's been trying to avoid any direct involvement in all of this. But with him being the closest to her since he lived with her, etc., I just, I'm really wondering what kind of bomb he's got cooking up in the bag. Is that evil of me to say that? Is it evil of me to be excited about seeing the Predator missile that he's about to drop on her? Like somebody put a nail in this fucking coffin so I could stop talking about this drama. Even my dog's getting upset. I know y'all hear him in the background. Listen to what Not The Click said. After playing Minecraft, I thought you couldn't dig yourself past bedrock. I stand corrected. Why is he cook he frying her? But see, it's so crazy because like, why? Why is she just still going? Just say you're sorry and try to fucking come back from this as best you can. I will say one thing though. Wonder made a GoFundMe so he'd be able to fight back any legal action Blair may take against him. But I'm kind of worried about Oz because I still haven't seen him make one. Honestly, I'm just really happy the internet, as a community, we're not letting her get away with this. So beautiful. But all that being said, I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to turn on post notifications, like, subscribe, and with that, I'll be out. Make sure you drink plenty of water and take it easy.